you cannot live without water. Water is everything. In the morning you wake up, you need to wash utensils. You need to wash the children's clothes. You need to cook. You need to ensure that there's good hygiene. And without water, this cannot be done. West Pokot is an arid and semi-arid county among the 23 counties in Kenya. And most parts of West Pokot suffer from lack of water. Recently, there was a demographic health survey that was done by the Department of Health. And West Pokot was lagging from behind. Out of the 47 counties, West Pokot was 46 leading in stunted growth among the children, and particularly the under five. And the main reason for this kind of data is because our children don't have good diet. And a child who is stunted at the 1,000 days of their life, that child's condition as the child grows can never be reversible. So the child is completely destroyed. When you go to school, these are the very children who don't perform well in school. The women spend the better part of their time, over 50%, looking for water. Some of these women have to go to fetch water when they are pregnant. So they are carrying a heavy load of the child here, and at the back they are carrying another heavy load of water. The women have so much work to do as compared to the men counterparts. The women are the ones who wake up in the morning to look for water for their children. The women are the ones who wake up in the morning to look for firewood. Le donne sono ehm, quelle che in casa eh, culturalmente si occupano della raccolta d'acqua insieme alle bambine addirittura delle volte. Questo occupa anche tutte le loro giornate, togliendo quindi tempo a quello che potrebbe essere la creazione di un business e la creazione soprattutto di un'indipendenza economica personale. L'acqua potrebbe essere un problema anche legato all'educazione in quanto soprattutto le bambine eh, non avendo eh, a disposizione acqua durante la giornata delle volte si vergognano ad andare a scuola per esempio quando hanno le mestruazioni o quando sono in scuole miste e non potendosi lavare. And I must tell you, these children are very bright. The problem that makes them know to perform, that's food and water. School is the only hope for this community. We are not able to farm because of uh, that uh, shortage of uh, water. Uh, maybe in a year we farm once annually. Uh, we have a small plot, two acres, and pawpaws, and also green grams. We train our farmers there, and also we make modern hive beehives. Honey is something that is very delicate, and we have to give out quality honey. But if you don't have enough water, that process will not be successful. Oltre all'agricoltura sostenibile ci occupiamo del cambiamento climatico e delle conseguenze del cambiamento climatico, che in un paese soprattutto come il Kenya si vedono tantissimo. Infatti siamo circondati tutti i giorni da situazioni per cui le famiglie, ehm, i business e tutte, tutte le persone e le comunità che vivono in questa zona hanno proprio eh, mancanza di acqua, vivono la siccità e quindi non possono, non riescono a sopravvivere come potevano fare per esempio dieci anni fa. And now I pray that the farmers once they'll be able to access water and have a mix of food on the table with different nutritional values so that we're able to improve the health of our children, improve our education and improve the life of the society. Thank you so much.